There are some dogs who just refuse to take treats when training. Are these dogs dogs that can't be trained? Absolutely not. They just take a little bit more understanding. And that's what we're gonna be talking about today in this video. Make sure you're subscribed and hit that bell for more videos just like this one. There are a few main reasons why your dog may not be taking treats in your training. And the first one is, is that they're not hungry. You heard me right, they're just not hungry. So how do we fix that? Well, for starters, you won't want to be free feeding your dog. When your dog has free choice of food all day long, the food, the reinforcement level of food just goes down because he has access to it all day. There's no reason he has to work for it. So my dogs are fed twice a day and when they are done eating, I pick up their bowls. I give them more than enough time to eat, but they do not get access to their food all day long. This creates a dog that for starters actually eats the food that is in his bowl. And as you can imagine, it also brings the value and reinforcement level of that food or the treats you're using in your training session to something that's more valuable. Another reason why your dog may not be taking treats is because he just doesn't find it reinforcing. The only way to reinforce a dog is to find something that he sees as reinforcing. So I have a question for you. What are you giving your dog as treats? If you're just using kibble, that might not be enough. The harder the behavior is, the more reinforcing your reward will have to be. For example, if your dog's playing with his other friends and you try to call him back to you, but you only give him a piece of kibble, you'll quickly find that your recall falls apart really fast. But what happens if instead you gave him a piece of cheese or even a piece of meat? Then your dog might want to come to you all the time because you have the best reinforcement. And if you're struggling to teach your dog recall, I'll put a link in the description as well as one right up here to my video on that. So your dog may not be hungry, he may not find the reward valuable, or he is over threshold. A dog that's over threshold won't be taking treats. They are so stressed that they're in fight, flight, or freeze mode. Their brains are made so that they cannot physically eat food at a time when they're stressed. So if your dog's showing signs of stress, like they're not eating, they have whale eyes, and just they're stiff, you're gonna wanna get that dog out of that area into a place where he feels more comfortable. This is for sure something you can fix, but it's not a simple explanation. And so if you want a video on it, put a comment down below and I will make it for you. So these are probably the three most common reasons why your dog won't be taking food. They're not hungry, they don't find it valuable, or they are over threshold and way too stressed out to eat. The most important thing is that we need to listen to our dogs and what they're trying to tell us. No matter what, your dog is giving you feedback and as responsible dog owners, we need to take that feedback and work with our dog to help him with whatever he's struggling with. That is all for this video. Make sure you are subscribed and hit that bell for more videos just like this one. Have a wonderful day guys and I will be seeing you in the next video.